What's up, everybody? What's up? Real quick. Uh, did you see last week's video on what the stairs and the staircase look like and all the work we had to do? If not, pause this right now and click this button right there. It's right there. It's right there. Last week's video. Woo! If you already seen it, then keep watching. What's up, everybody? All right, before you watch this video, all right, um, you are going to see my, woo, my insulation job. All right, now this is my first uh, step of insulating my walls, all right? Now, take it with a grain of salt, because as you watch this film, uh, you are going to see me using uh, this wall membrane, this plastic stuff, all right, that has dimples in it. All right, and you're also going to see me put it on the floor. Now, the first thing, take my advice with a grain of salt. And the reason for that is because your home is going to be probably most likely a lot different than my home. And why do I say that? Well, it's simple. Because if you've been watching any of my films or any of my footage since I started working in this basement... I did a whole French drain system all the way around the inside of my house to a main area for a sub pump, all right, a sub pump basin. So that way I could pump out any excess water that comes into my house, into my basement, all right. It will go to my drain system, to my sub pump. Now, since I was doing that, right, I uh, take the wall membrane, all right, and I bring it down the wall, as you're going to see in the film, in the video, I bring it down the wall into my French drain system, all right? So it goes into where my concrete is. I'm not just putting this on there so that way condensation just can draw, go all the way down the plastic, all right? And then onto my floor. Uh, I've seen a lot of videos out there. I've been in the trades now for over 30 years. Everybody says, I've been in, you hear people say it all the time. I've been in the trades for 30 years. Well, I've been in the trades since I was around 14 years old, actually younger than that. Um, working with my uncle and yada yada. And then I went through the union, the carpenters union. I did that for 20 years. I've been in, the, and I'm almost 50 years old. I've been in the trades for a long time. All right. Long time. So there's situations for every different home, every different commercial building, everything that you do um, is going to be a little bit different. For example, if you have an open trench, right, with your French drain system and a tile system or however you're getting your water out of your house, then I would recommend using this. Now, let's say you have a damp basement, but you don't have your basement floor jacked up where you have a French drain system. If you put this against your block wall, friends, all you're going to do is bring condensation down and it's just going to keep going, right? And if your basement gets a flood situation, of course, it's going to wreck everything, all right? Um, so... Take it with a grain of salt. My advice is why why I'm using this and I why I'm doing these videos is mainly for entertainment for you to see what I'm doing and uh, to watch friends, yada, yada. And um, that's why I don't have a big channel. That's why when you see my videos, you don't see a lot of views because it's just friends watching friends stuff. But anyhow, that's why I'm using the wall membrane. Because if I'm using this, I can take it down my block wall, as you see in the video, and right into my drain system, all right? And then, on top of that, for added protection, I lay it on the floor. After I poured my concrete, I lay it on the floor. And then, for extra warmth, extra warmth, extra padding, extra whatever you want to call it. It's just an R1. It's only a quarter inch thick. Um... It's fan fold. Most people will use this for, let's say, a residing project. If they're going to reside their house and they want to put the this against their house and then they put their new siding on. That's a whole different video and everything else. But yeah, it's just padding. It's fan fold, quarter inch fan fold insulation. Um, I just 
lay it out, and then you'll see me uh, taping the seams. It's moisture, right? It's just to keep anything that might lead to moisture out of it. And then I put my subfloor on top of that. Um, another thing, you're going to see me. Now, if you are, all right, using this plastic stuff, Brothers and sisters, just buy yourself some cans of spray foam. Um, a lot of spray foam, of course, if you're going to tackle a pro bigger project or whatever size project. But this stuff, you squirt it on here. It doesn't have to be, you know, any science to it. Just squirt it on here. Boom, 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 boom. And then stick your uh, insulation up against it. Put something, wedge it. You'll see that throughout the video. Wedge it. Hold it into place as soon as this stuff dries against whatever you're putting on, it's there. And you'll see me wearing this shirt and these pants for the whole week of progress of doing this. Because when this stuff gets onto your clothes or your gloves or your hands or anywhere, it sticks. And friends, it's hard to get off. But no, that's, that's the reason for it. Um, so just take it with a grain of salt. It's a moisture deal for me. My home's going to be different than yours. Uh, I see a lot of misleading videos out there on using this stuff. You'll see them lay it on the floor, and then they'll put, let's say, insulation, or they'll lay it on the floor, and they'll put their subfloor on. Well, everybody knows, grab a coffee cup, whatever, plastic container, drink a soda outside in the heat. It builds up condensation, water bottle, whatever, right? Plastic builds up condensation. So for me, I'm not going to put wood up directly against this. So that way, the underneath or it can get all soggy and moldy. Now, that's the last thing I want to do. So that's why I lay the plastic down. I put the insulation down, fan fold insulation, whatever you want to call it, foam. Then I tape the seams really well. And then when I put my wood up against it, it's going to be fine. Just like when I go to in frame up all my walls, that will be the next video after this. I fr start framing up the stairway. And then I'll insulate again. And then I will put a poly vapor barrier on. But anyhow, that's that's the basics of this video. Hopefully you enjoy the video. Give me a like. Uh, please hit the subscribe button because we have all kinds of projects going to be coming. I decided to start to do... Now I'm finally getting to the point where I can do one project at a time and finish it and then go to the next. So the next few weeks is going to be us finishing this project, getting the stairs out and bringing them down and differently. Uh, but yeah, it's, uh, it's coming along really good. This is a sneak peek behind the scenes of what you're going to be watching. But yes, you can see uh, where the little space heater is. And the vacuum cleaner shop back. That's my subfloor already started, and I'm just slowly working my way that way. That's why all those seams are nice and and seamed off with the, the red tape. It's just um your typical like uh if you're gonna side your house or whatever, it's just seam tape. Alright, it's moisture tape. They call it duct tape, they call it a bunch of different things. But yeah, so when I bring my subfloor to the edges of every single wall I'm not gonna have to worry about moisture and you're gonna see me cutting a lot of that foam out and that's just because I like a nice clean clean look at when I'm done see that nice that's nice that's nice that's sexy that's sexy stuff that's nice look at that look at those nice seams I'll zoom you in real quick and then I'm gonna get off of here and let you watch the rest of the video if you want to it's up to you but yeah, so that's nice and sexy. That's nice and clean. And a uh, little bit overkill, whatever. I don't care. Like I said, it's sexy. And I don't care. But anyhow, it's it's a preference. It looks uh, when I bring my neighbors over and they're like, they want to see how it's coming. Uh, it doesn't look messy. It looks clean. That's That's clean. And when I go to insulate my walls and frame the walls, it's just clean. It keeps the bugs out too. Woo! Enjoy the video. One thing before I go, I just wanted to 
so that way it makes sense to you. This is my block wall behind the plastic, right? Behind the black. These are my seams. I taped the seams, all right? Um, then I put my plastic on here. And then, so that way the water can go down. But let's say you don't have a uh, um, wet basement. You have never had water issues. Can you glue this insulation right against your block wall? Yes, you can. Um, I personally don't recommend it because it's a preference to mine. Um, and everybody's going to have a conflict of interest on that. And if you're wondering what I was talking about, if you've never seen my videos, that's the next phase. Once it's framed, then of course I do my wiring behind it and yada yada yada. And then I insulate the wall and then I put a poly vapor barrier. And uh, vapor barriers are confusing in this world because like that plastic is one vapor barrier for me to keep the moisture on between that block wall and that black side, this side of the black, so it can go down into my French drain. Then the insulation keeps it insulated and warmth uh, back and forth, right? And then I'll put my other insulation on with my vapor barrier on this side, the plastic, to keep my heat. Because one side is going to be cold and one side is going to be warm. And then it just keeps going around. So that's basically it. And uh, if you're wondering why any of my videos look like crap or whatever, it's because I uh, bounced around a lot when I started making these films. I almost decided to delete them all and then start a whole new channel and I said piss on that. This is just for entertainment purposes. So enjoy the video. Sorry about the music. Uh, I don't know what to put on there for music so I just throw on a bunch of crap. Woo! Till next week. Once a week I'm going to try and make a video for y'all for every single progress I make. So hit that subscribe button please. I want to get to a thousand subscribers. So that way, when I want to, I can go live. Live. So you can talk to the beast live. Worth. I desire your worst, so you can just hide while I work. 
I ain't tired, you first I'll write a second, third verse About the lies you go disperse You never did shit, I know it hurts Something deep inside won't let me quit I swear that I'm inspired by all this shit Tell me that I can and I won't That's what got me the most Fuck your lies, I'll do what I want
things I've been driving this train Years in this lane, there's no stopping this flame Cause I came to the game and I changed it to play How I like rearranged it to my own domain Yeah, I got what it takes, made lots of mistakes Taking shots, skipping breaks, feeling lost, feeling great Popping off, singing straight, never stop, never changed All the squad here to play and I've got something to say, yeah I work hard each and every day I get lost in the words I say I don't push pause, no I push play I won't stop till I make a change I withdraw on the things I make I turn flaws into flawless traits I build tall, never cap in space I won't stop till I hear him say And I'm up again I got tired eyes Need a cup of blend That's right In the AM That's my only friend No light Just the sun Coming up on the horizon I lose track of time Yeah, I move fast and climb A new class divine Yeah, true passion shines And I'm through passing time I choose stacking dimes You snooze half the time While I move passing by uh. I work hard each and every day I get lost in the words I say I don't push pause No, I push play I won't stop till I make a change I withdraw on the things I make I turn flaws into flawless traits I build tall, never cap in space I won't stop till I hear him say Descriptive like an adjective I got a vendetta against people who patented Being negative when you should be getting after it I got facts over facts over tracks This and that, spitting slow, spitting fast I could roast, I could gas, think I'm okay at last But I don't know if that can erase all the past And the pettiness, a reflection of the emptiness Hilarious, you think you're with my time? You're delirious, mysterious Because you are behind a fake exterior Inferior, you know I'll always be a bit superior Get off of me, this ain't no humble brag I want you to hear words, you can say them back I want you to feel free from the chains at last And to believe in what you got, it was built to last, yeah now that I've been put through, I never got anyone's help. I had to do it all myself. I don't ever slow up, no, I don't take shit. I got no love for the fakeness. If you wanna play tough and wanna hate this, I'll always show up and make a statement. I don't ever slow up, no, I don't take shit. I got no love for the fakeness. If you wanna play tough and wanna hate this, I'll always show up. Make a statement I'm Gonna learn the consequence of being incompetent Mental health is confidence Dreams and some honestness I'm not here to save the day That's for you to take away I could play a million mind games But instead I say Something not illogical Something that is topical Rub it on and watch it go Make yourself unstoppable Dreams are irresponsible But they're always possible If you just believe You could be so remarkable Thoughts in my head A collage and they spread I'll be great one day Going off of my meds No I'm not giving up No I'm not giving in I will make it to the top Taking off in the wind, I gotta make it I'm saving every day to taste it I'm patient, but my mind, it can hardly take it I'm chasing a dream that I've had for several ages of bacon Modern kingdom for the taking Now that I've been put through I never got anyone's help I had to do it all myself I don't ever slow up, no I don't take shit I got no love for the fakeness If you wanna play tough and wanna hate this I'll always show up and make a statement I don't ever slow up, no I don't take shit I got no love for the fakeness If you wanna play tough 
up and wanna hate this I'll always show up and make a statement I don't ever slow up, no I don't take shit I got no love for the fakeness If you wanna play tough and wanna hate this I'll always show up Feel nauseous, believe me. Never had a lot of sh come easy. Had to work hard, struggle just to be me. Had to rise up just so they could see me. Did what I had to do just to feed me. And what was left over, I put towards my dreaming. But the only thing in life that has meaning are the things you gotta work for, believe me. Take into your hands a plan, your own hands can land your own brand and damn I feel like no one takes accountability, they want the credibility Convincingly unwilling to put in the f hours it takes to get some power Don't be f***ing sour, take a cold shower, scream until you're louder Work until you're prouder and f*** all the doubters, they're just your downers I swear to god they all let me down, I always fought just to wear the crown off at these f***ing clowns Who were all taught they deserve an ounce It's only worth it if you work for it It's only worth it if you work for it I won't stop till they hear me now I won't stop till I wear the crown to be seen when everybody wants to be king yeah they all wanna ring yeah we all wanna be free so show me what you got what you bring how you fight in the ring how you take a fucking swing do you got heart are you mean got some scars got some needs are you willing to go leave i swear to god they all let me down i always fought just to wear the crown i'm off at these fucking clowns who were all taught they deserve an ounce It's only worth it if you work for it It's only worth it if you work for it I won't stop till they hear me now I won't stop till I wear the crown I swear to God they all let me down Ooh, I gotta have it I ain't even playing Got a really bad habit If it moves, gotta grab it Fuse like a magnet Lose, won't have it Till I'm doomed in a casket I ain't playing Got a weird mind If you work eight hours I'ma work nine If the shit tastes sour You should taste mine I'ma stay in power For a long time Get up Nah, I ain't a quitter Toss me the ball I'm a really big hitter Big picture I'm a straight killer Rice in the song To the highest bidder Got juice, got gas I'ma move fast New shoes, new tracks like who's that? I'm new, 